to find the next big thing Saturday, November 17th and Sunday, November 18th from 3 to 5 p.m. at the I'll Holiday Inn, 4700 North Port Washington Road. Hey, this is Reggie Brown. I'll be one of the judges. All genres of music are welcome. The top finalists will compete for the grand prize. A chance to be featured on PMAC's YouTube television series. And you record a seven-song EP produced by Grammy-nominated producer-songwriter Chad C. Note It's brought to you by Pretty Boy USA Globe and Big Sound Music. That ain't something that happened frequently. Hey y'all! What the <laughs> fuck episode is this, yo? 53. 53. 53. 53rd Street School. Niggas, yo. 53rd Street School, man. Man, how y'all doing, though? This episode 50 trade though. Uptown what? Didn't know now. Ain't nothing significant to 53? Uh, hell yeah. Uh, Babe Ruth was 52, right? 53 would be, uh, <laughs> I don't know, no, I'm no, he was 42, I mean, uh, Jackie Robinson was 42, 42, 42 I'm yeah. to some sports, 53, 53. I wouldn't know no sports, let me see what's going on, I ain't got nobody with that number, bro, no niggas, <laughs> it was called, Mr. Jesus tagged me in the A's, this why y'all mad, ass been waiting on that heat to turn off, <laughs> <laughs> she just posted the A's, that's funny I could not deal. bitch, that's funny as a bitch, hey, uh, Damn, where am I supposed to be? Okay. Somebody said that I missed the podcast tonight. No, you ain't. You know what? We just, we just, just cracking up. This. Queez. Okay. We late. Yo, Fuck with Yo, us. Build this motherfucker up. We trying to get it cracking. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Kim. Really? Yeah, you know I was a cook. <laughs> Tootie. Chanel. <laughs> I'm sure. I what did you do, bro? Brina. Bree. She snapped the whole intro on what? Then they must we have heard the whole you. combo they behind the Bri. intro. Oh, what y'all heard the whole combo Dang, behind the intro? Dang, my bad, y'all. Man, let me what make up, sure y'all? we don't do no crime with this nigga doctor. <laughs> Shit, we going to jail, Rich boy. kid, what it do? I God, see you still damn. checking pockets on these fucking The saying, nigga looked right at us like, yeah, y'all go ahead and talk. Ashley, what it do? <laughs> Tamika, what it do? Doc still sleep, y'all. Don't mind Doc. Ron, nigga, what's up, y'all? My nigga still taking his nap. Hitting with the with the Reggie. They show said we snapped the whole intro. My bad, y'all. Y'all oh, was supposed to snapped. catch what that later. About? NBA, NBA young, young boy. boy and that baby in the club. Man, motherfuckers know rich kid every which province line. Mm-hmm. Nigga talking to another nigga on our motherfucking. Hey, up. Brina. Inbox that nigga. Pimp. Hey, y'all. What's happening? Yeah. They said she was going hard. Shit. Y'all was not supposed to hear that until the show that started. That was the mic check right there. Right. They heard everything. She yeah, Doc set hard. us up, Tamika. I wish she was going hard. Set us up for the okie doke. Mikey D checked in. Paris, what it do? Episode 53. De- definitely Share that set us shit. Up 53. Share that shit. Shout out to our sponsors. Bloopers. Shout out to the sponsors. Shout out to the motherfuckers. You be paying us. We love you. What voice is that? That's the Bill Cosby. <laughs> <laughs> Free the king of the Jello Jello Pudding Pop. Hey y'all! Hey, for real, rich kid, I seen that shit, man. Got these white bitch doing. Uh, hey Jessica. On, on, hey on, Ashley. From overseas. Hey Chanel. Everybody Boy, was saying hey to us. We wasn't saying nothing. Big Naya, what it do? <laughs> then don't low, what it do? Oh, uh, people were speaking Trey, and we weren't do? speaking back. Yeah, they was commenting when I was saying all that stuff. We didn't even know. Like it's right. plenty comments. Oh well, shit. Yeah. Let's jump off. We got anything to announce? 
Before we get off into this, we got any announcements? Well, we do have some surprises for y'all today oh, in the yeah, show, yeah, especially yeah. from Scale. It's one of y'all faves. And we have special guests later on. The Mud Bros will be Mud here. Bros they the have building. two videos that Fresh we Fresh off the stage and opening for NBA we'll, Young we'll Boy yesterday. They ain't in the building right now. I can't deal but with they him. will be in the building. So we gotta get we gonna give our pieces about the NBA young boy and then we'll get their opinion because they shared the stage with him last night. Ooh. So we'll see what they thought too. So they how do y'all feel about NBA young boy in general? That's where we gonna start it because obviously he's a very long topic. Like what well, was the status we back. just read? I just read a status. You twin, you know you twin. That he admitted to having herpes. He smoked cigarettes. The boy got that shit. He had his son in the club. <laughs> And women were still clamoring all over him last night trying they, to go home with him. I'm not going to lie. I've seen posts where girls post him and say MCM, and then everybody under, girl, he's so damn fine. Uh-uh, that's my babe. But y'all know this man got herpes. Like, so when y'all meet him, are y'all really going to, like, give Rick. him head and fuck him knowing that he finna burn you up? Like, I really want to know. How does that work? Hold on now. Because it's different Cause when you, you care about their talent. Daddy. And as long as you got some money, money she going to fuck you when you I'm come I'm sorry. Out. I'm not burning up my vagina for no money. I'm straight. You got to live with that shit for life. What happened when they he do leave anything you, for me, but you money just got in some Milwaukee. damn herpes for life? Man, you can have herpes in Milwaukee. You just can't be broke. I'm telling you. Yeah. Yuck. I'm Yuck. Telling. That I'm is gospel. not okay. That's gospel right there. Do y'all feel me? I feel you. Do y'all feel me? I don't. Come on, man. Do y'all feel me? You not you burning can, me up. In Milwaukee, you can... Be burning, they still gonna fuck with you. As soon as the bitch say, Oh, that nigga burned me, such and such, somebody wanna be his bitch. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and <laughs> listen, and then you could have herpes, man. Yeah. A motherfucker can say everything about you. You can say you got AIDS, all that shit. As long as you got some money, you are an exception. They I want just that don't. Hot dog. They, um, no. Usher was not an exception. <laughs> when they want that hot dog. He had it. They was mad. At they Usher. was mad at Usher when he came out and he had an STD. But it's okay for little dude to have that. That's just not okay. Fucking niggas with that pack. These hoes nasty and brave. I like. That. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I love our viewers. They he don't be playing, yes. bro. Man, most of the hoes that was trying to get get up with him was gonna give it to him <laughs> anyway. They was gonna give him hurt. What? They don't give. A fuck they up. wish he would take that rubber off. They get a baby and they. They think they getting shit up. He ain't got it. He gonna get it. Well, you know what? What I will say to Lanise, I believe. I hope Fuck I said it right. Up. She said, I like his music and that's all. Like, nothing else matters. And I agree with that. I like his music. Real. And you have to separate people from, like, the person that they personally are and then, like, they actual music. I listen to that boy all day. But I just don't understand how you could lust after somebody that yeah. you know, if they fuck you, are going to burn like, you the fuck up. That's just not said, okay. Money outweigh that STD. No, the fuck <laughs> it does not. That money ain't going to be for life. If he dump you and leave you for the next thought, you burning for life, baby. You have kids. <laughs> your kids got herpes. That's not okay. At least they rich kids. They ain't yuck, rich. They, they, they rich yuck kids with yuck. the herpes. Shout I'm out rich kid. Okay with this. Um, Shout out since rich we kid. since we talking about him as a whole. Wow, Pac Larry him as a whole, he's a great oh, artist. Him as a whole, amazing artist. I I actually yeah. got to give him more credit than I be giving him because he only 18 years old. Oh yeah, he's you know very what I'm young. So, um, his music is actually really good to be 18 years old. His music is better than some 20 year old motherfuckers. In the music thirty year olds right now, yeah, yeah, some thirty forty year olds. Real, what yeah, do? yeah. I think it depends. He got a lot of body of work. Like since he dropped to me, he been very consistent. You, you know, know what I'm saying? Throwing themselves at him, the so called bad bitches. I was just about to say, it's all level of bitches that's throwing themselves at him. If you look at it, this happened man, just on go Instagram watch the video, too. He man, upload videos show, on Snapchat man. with bitches all day. These are your IG models and all of that that got money from what they doing. They still want to fuck him. I just don't get it. They do what they want to do when they pop it. <laughs> Yuck. Right. Motherfuckers said they never heard of him. Madonna, you need to slow asleep, baby. You yeah, need to wake yeah, up and yeah, get the fuck yeah. out the house. <laughs> it's the new little boost. So yeah. how was his concert since everybody is speaking on the music then? What song he got? Oh, my God. Who said that? I'm going to need y'all to wake up, people. Well, he's 18. Up, up, Some of our viewers up. are older, and they probably don't, don't pay you attention. Can't, you can't, uh, I don't know a little Pump song still. But even if you don't listen to his music, you can't help it. They're going to play it somewhere. I don't know it, though. I don't know if that's I'm him. I'm just saying. You know you heard So she it. probably heard him. She just don't know that it was him. 
Yeah. You done heard what that boy before, hurt. trust me. Yeah, you done heard him they a lot. They want that actually. hot dog. He said it. She said it again. They want that hot dog. Oh, that just concert. Okay. That concert was, uh, that motherfucker was We Up Next concert. Shout really? out to We Up Next. Yep, I heard they, they shut that heard motherfucker they stole the down. Show. Wait, they at the raid? better show the NBA Young the Riverside. Boy. Riverside, Riverside. And okay. I'm standing on it. I'm standing on that. We Up Next, Fresh, and We Up Next, Great. Snap! Shout out Bobby Joe and uh Fresh. What all songs did um he do? Uh, what did who do? Young boy. Man, okay. young boy did that shit. <laughs> I'ma keep it real, but he didn't perform the songs. He was letting his brother rap the motherfucker. Oh. Like man, you niggas out here playing with that money. Well, so we already know that this nigga ain't uh. This nigga ain't came and just gave them no short ass show. It was yeah, some problems with that paper, some, man. Yeah, it had to be something going uh, on. It was some problems scene. with that paper. No, nobody come out there and do no shit like that. But he, I mean, he came out like he was about to snap. He got to take it off shit. You know what I'm saying? After one song, he got to take it off a hoodie. The next song, he take off a chain. The next song, he take off a shirt. He was getting it in. And then he was gone. I sat down and rolled up. He was gone. I'm like, damn, what the fuck? The lights on. <laughs> <laughs> God. Well, did the what? kids that were there seem to enjoy oh, it? I heard kids. y'all had a problem that there were kids there, too. Ain't kids no kids. Like there wasn't no kids there. It was babies there. I was talking about motherfuckers literally was holding babies. Like, literally. Like, bitch. Like, <laughs> bitch, that's, <laughs> bitch, that's an eight-month bitch. <laughs> On our hip, huh? <laughs> bitch, this a session, bitch. This ain't... This were the ain't, babies by the smoke? This ain't stay fair, bitch. This is... The shit. This is where the niggas going. This is the rave, bitch, tonight. Thanks. NBA young boy gonna be here, all these grown ass niggas. And they smoking dope. Niggas smoke from 7 to 11. They said the kids was lit, though. The kids was high. For sure. <laughs> Police was there. They said he was on a pill. That's why he was taking his clothes man, off. Man, everybody was on a pill. I'm I looking at everybody. Say, that's normal. I'm sure. looking at their lips out of crew. Oh my God! <laughs> we gonna sit on that. <laughs> Motherfuckers was high. I can, not, I can. He said, "Gotta start them early. Cut it out." Man, what? Don't be that way. He was burning up literally. That ain't. That ain't. That to me, don't you know? Shout out to everybody who like gave their kid that experience, and their kids wanted to go see that. But me, I couldn't have had my child there. And that's, that's just my. You know what I'm saying? Like. And that's hell. another thing I was about to say. His music ain't for like if you ain't in like if you ain't got a driver's license, you probably shouldn't be listening to to NBA Young Boy. No, for real. Like if you in like middle school, you he shouldn't you shouldn't be listening. But to that's NBA who's Young listening Boy. to him. I know. That's, that's what I'm that's saying. That's who was that's at the who's concert. Listening to him. Man, what? Yeah. Yeah. That nigga said how, he had his first kid at 13. 10, that is yeah. not. Who the your kid, kid Josie? Four babies at seventeen. Some people didn't know that. Nah. Yeah. Why would there be an all age event and y'all allowing them to smoke weed in there? You ain't allowed that was him, Sharita. That stop that. Who Sh won't stop I that? mean, they uh, they uh, had to allow it. Security could have kicked you out if they didn't Who allow smoking. You, you can't one. stop they no can't motherfuckers stop from no smoking one, on no girl. concert. I ain't never. Ain't nobody stopping no, me from smoking on no concert ever in life. That's the whole thing. At that, a concert that I, think, that I think a lot of our you city. You got ten thousand people in here, and you got three thousand of them smoking. I, the other 2,000 trying to hit the weed for free. You know what I'm saying? I feel you. I think that's what our city don't get about concerts, though, is that you can smoke at concerts. I didn't know that. Yeah, I, I think Milwaukee don't get that about concerts. That's why they don't get up to go to concerts. He's, like they he's get up to go to Kiss kid. and 618 or Lavish when a celebrity dare. I get up to go to the rave because we can do what the fuck we want to do at the rave. Literally. You see what I'm saying? The white kids is in there doing whatever they want to do at them concerts. So that's what I'm saying. That's why I like that experience. Tonight it says security than, was you know smoking too. Yeah, they security was smoking was. too. Remember I the boot. Remember the little Boosie concert. What was security gonna do with them people? Nothing. Nobody was sitting in their seats, my nigga. Nothing. There's nothing well, they could do with them people. Little Boosie events. I don't even know what's the use. But of he's security, the new little everyone, Boosie though. Everyone. I don't know. Let me tell you this. Young boy's the new they little Boosie. A bag boy. They the sold fake tickets, yeah. real tickets. <laughs> Made a meal ticket. <laughs> man, yeah. what? If you bought a two hundred dollar holla, icon. Yeah. If you bought a two hundred dollar holla, your shit was not valid at that door. Ooh. Yeah, Sharita, that was really? his baby in the club. Who baby? Oh yeah. yeah. Young boy, yeah, that was him. He brought his baby to. Kiss. He had his baby and kiss. I, if I could take my son to kiss, I probably would. Like nigga. I cannot. No, I just fuck with. You. I'm just. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. Don't know. Don't call me on that. Mm. 
Man, what? The white kids was there too. Yeah. Oh yeah, they love that. They Man, love what? The culture. Bro, yeah. hold on. Yeah, he popular they knew as fuck. every word, word for word. Mm-hmm. He popular as fuck. Like, and when you oh, think of his superstar, yeah, when you think about sure. like his uh, his, the range of his audience is is real big mm-hmm. because of how young he is for one, and then his alliances in the game. It's Baby, Young Thug, Wayne, all these people. Boosie, they co-signing dog. Kevin Gates, these grown men with yeah. million, with real fan bases. Mm-hmm. Man, motherfuckers got forty dollars tickets, man. Get what I'm saying? Get so me. then when you and then the Ooh, thing about him is, is me. when you listen oh, to the music, it ain't a bunch of been it ain't a bunch of auto tune goofy Who shit. Was you know what I'm saying? They were selling them at the stores. And they were fake. Yeah, when you once you once you got to the venue, you couldn't use those tickets. Ooh. Let me, let me, they said all if you spend two hundred dollars though for something, you gonna think that shit real. He said people was getting in with forty dollar tickets and getting rejected who paid two hundred dollars. Damn, on what y'all ain't seen him with his baby? <laughs> man, what? Yeah, he had his baby all up in Kiss. Man, all the club videos I seen the NBA young boy, his baby was in every Hold video. On. Forget that. I'm talking about the kids that was at the thing, bro. At the concert. Like, okay, okay, I can see ten year olds knowing <laughs> no, these songs. It was I can see kids. kids but no, it was motherfuckers in there actually holding babies. I believe That's that, different. Bro. On their hip. That's different. Hip. I That's different. That, bro. CPS shouldn't have been up in that bitch. Like how if much smoke that little and alcohol costs? in the room and it's an eight month old baby. How much bitch. the baby tickets cost? Right. <laughs> Listen. Dawson, I seen the video. These was hoes were trying to hold his baby. Yep. They was reaching out for his baby and shit. Oh, oh y'all. <laughs> Y'all hoes a hoes. I ain't had no forty dollars okay? ticket, nigga. I was That's in the pit. I was in the front. <laughs> <laughs> I walked to the back because it was too crowded up there. The was kids. Don't ever charge two hundred. The kids was in the front. Man, what? the kids was in the nigga. As soon as we got there, the kids had a fight what? out the gate. As soon as we got there, the kids had a fight. I don't know. I like, know, you teenagers? know it's a kid fight. I walked off like, oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> Man, they was dead high. Yeah, it was a force. It was too many little, like for real though. Like I can see, you know, Fam, he's kids 17. that's about to be teen. I can see kids that's about to be teenagers, ten and on up, eleven see, and on up. See, when he points that out, I, I see why it's that. that. Because if he's seventeen, you got to think about his fans. He probably got fans that's all the six years She's old that old, fucking bro. love look, him, look, think, listening to the edited look, version big, and love big, him, worship him. What I'm saying is like. 15 years ago, it was Bow Wow and mm-hmm. Romeo and these niggas. They were 17. Mm-hmm. But they rap was clean. It was the candy rap. Fam mm-hmm. is Bubble street rap. rap, and he's 17. Mm-hmm. Come on. See what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Dog rapping That's that herpes in my blood. blood. Herpes in my blood. Selling this pings. Nigga is... Robbing the plug. Mm-hmm. He talking about robbing the plug. He's 17. Herpes in my blood. I bet y'all won't See, steal that. And when you think about his music, talent, when I listen his to his age, music, talented. he Let sounds so much <laughs> older in his music. So you I forget how fun. old he is because he done been through so much shit. I <laughs> and, and gonna keep it real like NBA. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you don't get the same response. I mean, so don't do it. I got that herpes in my blood. <laughs> I'm sure it's probably people with herpes. I oh see, shit! Right? I ain't listening to no. Ain't no edited version. It's not. Oh, it got, it's an edited version of man, everything. Ain't no more edited version. On title, it's always an edited version. Right. I'll be pissed. Years old, lit, lit. Hell yeah, that's that's the age. That's yeah, what I'm Sanaya, saying. that's what you. I, I salute that's you. That's what Sanaya. I was thinking. That, they was like, it's all ages. I'm thinking, okay, it's gonna be a 19. bunch of teenagers here. No, me and Spoil you know looked it up. Saying? Me and Spoil looked it up. He's 18 years old. He turned 18 in October. He on the song with Lil Yachty. He say, I'm 17 with four babies. Yeah, oh, yeah. that song came out last year. Last year, yep. Oh, I know that song. <laughs> oh, babies. That nigga, his mama, his mama like 35, man. For real. <laughs> like, Young you know mother. What I'm like, he ain't even. Babies having babies. <laughs> 17 and out here, that's why. Yeah, he ain't 19 at all. He's still a kid. That's why the kids is on fam like that. That he, nigga cold, though. I'm going to keep it real. You know, the bad they said the stuff he rapping popular. about, kids shouldn't be listening no, to at all. The shit he rapping, rapping, rapping about, about, kids should be. Definitely not be listening to. That's why his shit ain't on V100. His shit too gutter. Yeah, he gutter gutter. Yeah. No, you was 13 listening to Snoop. The average 13-year-old wasn't listening to Snoop, though, Jeweler. 
You know what I'm saying? We was listening because we was into the culture. I was listening you to Bow You got to take the average kid. Bow Wow was Destiny's Child. Yeah, Big it was facts. motherfuckers like that. And Nowadays, Michael. there are no Michael groups Jackson. like that. Oh, what? I bet they won't still laugh. You know what I'm saying? There are no That's groups like that bit. anymore. Everything is like even the little videos my daughter be watching the rappers on YouTube. Them niggas be cussing like a motherfucker. Like, ain't nobody. That's ain't man, really clean. Yeah, no young more. boy, the realest rapper ever. Damn near. Ain't nobody gonna admit to having herpes, man. Yeah. No. no. I, I give him. I applaud him for his his. He was confident to say that. He had to Gates like Gates like man. Tell like them that, people, okay? man. Tell them you. That, you, that takes you some got bravery. That shit, man. But that like y'all no just pointed out, if his mom only thirty five and he eighteen, that's babies having babies. That's Gates just a cycle like that's gonna shit, continue to happen. He got four <laughs> babies already at what age? That's just gonna continue to happen. Exactly. And it's mad that Sorry, now God. he influences <laughs> such a large mass of kids. <laughs> Kevin Gates probably like shit, man. Fuck it, man. I got herpes too. <laughs> Anyways. He's married, okay? I was even telling people no, like, you got herpes, man. I told Drika. I, I told no, no, Drika I heard her, she sucked my dick. I'm saying he not out here still <laughs> doing all of that. I'm I'm just saying. Oh, Listen, Kevin Gates is a good man. Up, Don't y'all. put that evil on him. Yeah, He's a good man. Don't put that evil on him. Girl, please. I'm saying, stop slandering that man when we don't know what he doing. Y'all don't know like I don't know. He's a married man, so I'm going to wish him the best. All right. Well, they they openly are doing it. OG. I was listening to Too Short at 11. Too short was listening to that. Too Short one, too short one rapping like Young Boy, though. He was saying bitch and bounce that yeah, ass and shake that monkey. Was, that ain't nothing to be the, listening all to all at, 11. at 11. Was it all at 11? Was it all the boys is managed though? 10 years old when I started he wasn't rapping. Saying, do, have y'all listened to an NBA Young? I don't think shit. niggas is listening to NBA like, Young Boy, bro. Oh, okay, mean? yeah, that's about right. If you compare a too short content to little no, too no, short is no, he G rated compared to NBA Young Boy. <laughs> Well, for a girl, I feel like too short is worse because I would rather no. listen. Listen, let me finish. I'm talking I'm, about for a kid. I'm. Let me explain. I have a seven-year-old daughter, and when too. she in the car, Kevin she Gates can listen cheap. to that. I ain't Drinking going outside today, and all the potion, the number nine. He can. She can listen to all that. She don't know what that's about. But if too Mitch, short come on, bounce that pussy and Talk shake that ass and all of that, hell no. I would much rather her listen to drugs and shit she don't understand than pussy and ass awesome. and bitch. No, thank you. I love them, but not for my Bitch. daughter. Not for my daughter. What are you smoking? A big fat dick coming from East Oakland. Classic bars. That's why he's still relevant, because his fan base is females. Man. Too short sure had them bars. <laughs> what? No, we don't. Too short sure had them bars. <laughs> Damn, too short, still relevant right now, bro. Boom. He was. Ba boom, ba boom, ba boom, Come on, man. I'm gonna Google him. Life is too short. She gonna Google who? She don't know who's too short. That shit used to slap. But NBA young boys got herpes, kid folks. And niggas ain't real like NBA. NBA the realest rapper ever, nigga. Niggas ain't telling motherfuckers they got that shit, bro. <laughs> motherfuckers ain't coming out the closet Shut like up, that. Shut up, spoil. That don't make him the realest rapper. That is enough. He is Kay? the realest. That's enough. Oh, my mama freaky tales. These are the tales that I tell so well. Man, freaky tales. I, that was the first time I got a blowjob. We already played some NBA Young Boy for y'all before when we tale. discussed the herpes to. line. I had to we play We played that. that for y'all. When I brought her to the crib, and I, I played And I think LaDonna was watching that episode. Bam. These are she the tales. La- the La- freaky tales. No, I'm saying, LaDonna oh. keeps saying she don't know who These he is at all. These are the tales oh. that I tell so well. You don't NWA like my dirty was political, nap. and I love it, and that's different. <laughs> you don't like my they, I mean, they had some bad songs, never mind. But most of it was political. Huh? Head lighter. He was like, what about N.W.A.? N.W.A. is bad for kids. But if you listen to them now, yeah, like it wasn't that type of rap. Yeah. They were still, tell, they was, they was still telling you to be like, they were still telling you some real shit, yeah. dog. Mm-hmm. And Lil mm-hmm. Dog is, stay out my business, Ricky. All right. You, com- you would compare him to them? He worse than them. Worse than them? Yeah, yeah I believe he worse than them. Because there's no filter on the content now, bro. That's what saying, I'm saying. I ain't saying I got the wing wrong. That's what I'm saying, bro. NBA, the realest rapper, bro. Niggas ain't going to tell they flaws, bro. 
This y'all nigga like, yeah, I got all the money in the world. Somebody said too short, not relevant at all. But I got herpes. What? Who said that? Yeah. They tripping. Yeah, right he just there. dropped the CD. And he be on like them white girls. Bro, like, I can't agree with them you, Them pop-ass white if girl records on Kiss FM, on swear to God. Right now? Oh, uh, Brie is too featured short. on records in the really? top 100 no, right no, now. No, 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 See, no, no, and I figured. No. First of all, he from California. What too the fuck short. Are y'all and everybody about? loved that one line. He no old rapper from California is irrelevant. Ever. They never, you can't get irrelevant. Yeah, for you, yeah. E-40 and them niggas don't get old, man. They fan base. E forty is one person nephew, that nephew. annoys the fuck out of me every time he talk. That man, what do he be calling people? What what E forty be calling? Mister Three G's, what it do? Huh? What do E forty be calling people? My weevils. And then it's a it's a civilization. My weevils. My weevils. The weevilization. That's, the That's what he calls it. Weevilization. Uh, dictionary. I hate it. I hate everything about it. He yeah. makes up words. She swallow. Ooh, that was my shit. That old NWA when they was making them, man. Listen, that was a lot of that was a lot of dope songs back then, man. Niggas, but they got a lot of dope songs now because that nigga NBA young boy Cole. And the reason I say he's the realest rapper is because these rappers are not telling y'all they have herpes. No, they won't do it, ladies. He's gonna whip that that uh, bruised up boy I'm out. Gonna, I'm gonna keep it. I'm Drake gonna come out and say he had an STD. Who? Drake, because bitches gonna yeah, still want Drake. Yeah, he Drake could come out quick it. and say he got an STD. Yeah, absolutely get away. And with bitches will still be going. Yeah. Wayne could too. For NBA young boy to be this early in his career doing that, but I'm gonna tell you that's what it is with him. His fan base. He got a fan base where you can't even quantify the numbers because kid, kids don't even, roaches, right? they don't even got cell phones. And I don't. <laughs> no, the babies that spoil talking about at the concert, Doc, they don't have cell phones. Her daughter don't got a cell phone, but when she get in the car, she want to hear NBA Youngboy. See what I'm saying? So he, you can't even. My really, daughter want to hear Bruno you Mars. You can't even count his numbers. Or Prince. Is what man, I'm, I'm saying. I'm the realest rapper out of Milwaukee. I'm the first motherfucker to, addiction, to admit my addiction. Perk confection. Perk confessions. <laughs> <on the way. laughs> I can't hear. That goes Tula Wula. Tula Wula, what it do, man? I love E 40. Me too. I'm sure. Dog said, it's a quarter after nine on my AM FM. It sounds Radio just Shack. like him. Digital Ugh, Motel 6 Clock Alarm Rings. Bodie, get your <laughs> ass up. It's time to hit the grind. <laughs> can't I afford can't the loan out no money. I know you heard about that. What? <laughs> Task rated man, Ms. and Ms. Miller had a heart attack. Every time he hop on something, <laughs> it makes me upset. Man, E40 was cold. He hopped on that, uh, that I don't fuck with you, Big Sean, Big Sean song, and I was huge. pissed. He Big ruined Big everything Paul, about it. I that. hate it. Let me see the light up, Sport. That I don't fuck with you by Big Sean. He ruined it. Bub used to be like. He ruined Bub it. Used to- <laughs> Bub used to be he, saying like E40 of uh, uh, throat slippery as a bitch. I swear. E40 took E40 took uh, I don't fuck with you to another level. No, he did we not. We breaking he up. Ruined it. He made that rec- that made the record he official. He ruined it. When he breathed on it, that made no. it official. Like, oh, okay, no. this this cold for real now. Big, who like yeah. that? They said we breaking up. What? He went crazy on it. Our shit breaking up, can't vote. Yeah. They saying it's breaking up. For real? We sorry, y'all. We don't know what's happening. The devil trying to keep us down. Stay with us. Pray for us. Ooh. (laughs) Kids go crazy over young boys. They do. They do. All ages. Old women too. Grown women. They willing to catch herpes for him. That's why he felt bold enough to come out and say that. Because his fan base is so big. I feel like that was a dare. Somebody dared him to do that shit. I'm telling you. I just think that's how real it is. Sugar, sugar. You can do that. Say my name. (laughs) This generation don't really judge people. (laughs) That's my sister. They favorite rappers is drug addicts and and women abusers and shit. They don't really judge people in this era. That's our generation. Yeah, that shit true. is over with. It's time period. They don't give a fuck about none of that. That's part of their whole, that's yeah, part of their whole, that's what make you people. real. Yeah, that's so that make you realer. Than section them. they was at the concert. I can No, it was a lot of. It was yeah, they be of defending them there, though. But it was motherfuckers just. Man, it was just so many kids. E forty one. On that's law. Yeah, he was on uh, Yo Gotti. That's law too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Told you, Forty be getting features. Him and Too Short, they still she relevant. She, she said she hated that Forty was on uh, 
Uh, Big Sean is Big one of the Sean. best to me. He's underrated a lot. He messed up that song's whole no, vibe. He yes, he did. He took it to another level. He ruined it. Big like, baby bro. be coming in, ruining <laughs> shit, bro. just bro. hopping Slippery on stuff. Birdman, that's what he did. How yeah. did he be hopping on shit Big and just ruining really it? That's didn't what even he really did. Fit on the West he Coast ruined it. Until a West Coast quarter after the nah. Well, baby. <laughs> Radio, because they always come on somebody's song and fuck it up. They wasn't asked, they wasn't need, none of that. They just slide in, talking about nothing, bunch of nothing. Listen, artists be loving a lot of weak people that they put on their stuff. It happens. They they shine features. I'm not saying E40 is weak. I'm just saying his voice is so annoying. It just sound like Charlie Us. Oh, yeah, they probably do got a cricket. That Y'all just said too short. I like too short. I love too short. I love him. Charlie what? Because his, his, his fan base is women, Bree. What we just said. So who is a man rapper that's been in the game for a long time that women don't like? E-40 might be the only one. Really? Yeah, because Snoop has a huge female fan base, too. Snoop Dogg, and that's why he's still relevant. Women don't listen to Dr. Dre? Yeah, my mama likes Snoop, my nigga. Women don't like Dr. Dre? Yes, they do. You crazy. Women love Dr. Dre. Give me an old rapper that women don't listen to. That's, like, not appealing to women. That's still relevant right now. That's still relevant right now. That's not appealing to women. That women don't, like, wouldn't buy his record. But he's still relevant. Nas? I think women love Nas. Women love he Nas. He be MC women like love Nas. Bro, he, I, I don't like Nas because I like Jay-Z for years, so they'll I'm just stream biased. It. But they'll stream yeah. it. Hell no. <laughs> Jeweler, they'll stream that motherfucker. Yeah, they fuck with They him. like he how be, he look. He be yeah. bitches MCM all the all time. The time. All like, the he time. He's one of the top five MCM niggas on my IG. Yeah. See, no, no, yeah, no, we done named all the rappers. Give we us an all artist. The rappers. Ain't none of them realer than NBA young boys. Give us an artist, you guys, that has Nigga been in the game longer than 30 years blood. that women would not go out and buy his album. You ain't got one. What? That's what he asking. 40 the only it's one got I could probably E-40 think of. E-40 ain't the only one. It's other people. I'm telling you, ain't no other ones. Anybody that lasts that long, Hell Brie, no. you have to have a female. E-40 that nigga. You have to have a female fan base. There's no way you lasting that long without a female fan base. E40 don't. Push a T well, I mean, don't got a female I, I fan base. Push, push, push don't. But Push a T was in a group that had a female fan base for a very that's long true. time. That's and true. Justin Timberlake Bun helped him co- cultivate Bun a female UGK. fan base. UGK. 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 Okay, I give you, I give you Bun B. I guess. Snoop. Huge female this fan base. Snoop. You tripping, nigga? This nigga's all on TV with his family <laughs> and all kind of shit. He do reality TV, my nigga. At the, at the point where this nigga's on stage. Oh my mama, dog. Yeah, hippopotamus. <laughs> <laughs> dog, do be like, I gotta be more hip than a hippopotamus. <laughs> Get off your head, Prodigy. neurologist. Prodigy doesn't have a. But she more way backless. Dog. Got a part about the name of two backless. He did. Backless. Man, he did. 707, my roots for hell are back to. No, I used to Listen, be dead people are still relevant. Fabulous. They still, still relevant. Re- Why? Records. Because women think fabulous is fine. He's still relevant. Okay, so you can just Wu Tang niggas. All right? So some of the Wu Tang niggas. Bitches love Method Man. Yeah, I was just about to say, so, bitches said, love Wu Tang. He can carry the group. Scarface. He can carry the group, Jula. You Scarface. only need one Those dude in the group. Oh, Scarface. But Scarface ain't relevant. Okay. No, he ain't really that relevant right now. Scarface can drop the ball out right now. That motherfucker gonna go extra wood. Let me get a light. Yeah. Um, Fab Teeth was fucked Duh up for a chingy. long time. He even rapped about how fucked, Duh said fucked chingy. up his KRS one. Hell no. Bitches love Ja Rule. Y'all are tripping. Anybody now. Yeah, because bitches love Ja Rule. Ja Rule Look at Fifty relevant. Cent. Fifty Cent still relevant. Duh Huge female I fan base. Chingy, chingy was a homo. I mean, female I fan base. Fifty a, got a. But he fuck with the he fuck with the trainees. Not the trannies. The trainees. Females love 50. That's why he always had his shirt off. His shirt was not off for the niggas. He wasn't showing y'all his muscles. That was for the women. I mess with Bun B, too. Yeah, everybody like loved Bun B. Don't nobody like Bun B. Nobody yeah, everybody does. Chingy. Everybody nobody. loved Chingy, though. Nobody. Before nobody this came out, right now. he was doing the... He's not relevant right now. <laughs> so what was the last track Bun B was on? Hey, guess, guess who Bun show B. I went... Hold on. Guess who Damn. show I went to? <laughs> you couldn't move it, the motherfucker. This is this song. Nelly, huge female oh, fan Nelly, base. Oh, yeah, yeah. Who? Nelly. Nelly, huge female Nelly fan base. Those. That's what Nelly, I'm saying. Nelly got all those herbies, too. He Niggas with that. longevity got huge female fan base. I'm going to need you to cut it out. And that's what keep you going. Niggas ain't so niggas gonna niggas gonna start hating on you after a while. I like 50 because 50, 50 a bully and he get away with it. 
I don't like him because of that exact reason. Somebody need to beat his ass. Until he get beat, I ain't gonna, I, then I'm going to jump. Luke, yeah. When he get his ass whooped, I'm going to jump. Plus. Until then, I'm Ain't nobody ever challenged base. for him and Floyd to get in the ring. He don't want to get in the ring with Floyd. I want him to get in the fucking ring with Floyd. Floyd will beat the fuck I out of him. I want that to happen. Floyd. Challenge Floyd him to that. that He'll shut him up. Challenge him but to that. But if 50 grab him, Floyd done. Floyd quit though. So, no, listen. 50 grabbing Floyd done. I don't believe that. Man, what? Floyd going to beat that man ass. He's going to beat that man ass, okay? Round Hell, for round. He's too little, too, Bree. You got to think. He yeah. quick. 50 big and old and out of shape. Yeah, he definitely not out of shape. He is <laughs> out of shape. 50. You said who will win? Floyd. Yes, Floyd will win. Hell yeah. Hands down. Young that Bird. ain't even no conversation. Bitches loved Young Bird. Who said that? Cause you. Duh, I saw that shit on the news, bitches bro. Bitches loved Lil Zay. On what he do? Nelly's got. Nelly they got still Herbie. like Nelly though. Yeah, they gonna fuck. Nelly bring it, bring it home Nelly. to their man. Bow Wow mm -hmm. still relevant. Bow Wow got herpes. Flavor Flav got herpes. <laughs> Flavor Flav kissed every bitch on this show. He got herpes. Boosie he definitely got herpes. Boosie from Bad Rouge. That Rouge. show used to crack. Every nigga from New Orleans got herpes. It don't matter if Floyd is trained. 50 always talking about how he can't read, so Floyd needs to challenge his ass to a fight. And I bet you that shut his ass up for good. Period. Floyd definitely smaller than Bree. I don't think Floyd can hurt 50. No, he not. not. Yes, he is. Floyd's Bree. shorter than me. You more than him. Yeah, about, mm -hmm. about boss B height. Man, he's what? Than boss he's, really? Yeah. He's, a, he's not a heavyweight champion. He's a lightweight champion. champion. <laughs> <laughs> I think he was that short. Man, he get his ass. That's why I said if he grab him, man, that man gonna get his ass beat. In a, in a real fight. Man, and he got herpes. Not he rich, medicine. so he got great medicine. I cannot deal. Ain't he Sanaya? Man, that motherfucker got saying herpes, everybody man. got herpes. I don't herpes. care, man. But <laughs> the realest nigga in the game admitted to it. That don't make him the realest nigga. What if it's he other did real tell niggas? He Floyd to read a Dr. Seuss book. That should, that should have been made him want to fight. Exactly. He should have beat his ass. Don't say Ice Mom. Shorty thick than the motherfucker. Project Fat 50 got nine, shot nine times. But it's people that are real that don't have herpes, so they don't have to say that they Floyd fucking got herpes. 50, that bro. don't make him the realest. In a boxing match, yeah. In a street in a street match, 50 gonna get him, bro. But then everybody got herpes, huh, Spool? Basically. <laughs> Keep your condoms. Keep your condoms and stop putting your mouth on everybody. Please. Please, guys. Y'all do that. Y'all go giving, kiss y'all kids. Y'all giving them hair like government cheese around this mm. motherfucker. It's easy. It's so easy to get some hair. Just get it together. Everybody get hair. Hair that all time high in Milwaukee. All right. We're going to get through these before herpes. our guests come. Herpes. 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 Herpes yeah, is in Milwaukee. Like. NBA young boy just and left. Heartbreak. And you know what he left. <laughs> herpes. He fucked something. That's just nasty. Let's just keep it real. He's Milwaukee hoes. Get oh, he's taller than me. Fast. Five four is taller than me, y'all. I'm five two. Mm. I guess. I'm five three. Well, because we have a special guest coming, and we also have a special feature from one of y'all hosts here, I'm gonna get I'm through our celebrity this. news. Go what? ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I'm, ta I'm talking to them. You sick of what? Damn, I'm talking to him. He, he got the realest STD. No, he the realest rapper. The realest STD is AIDS, it. okay? And no, Easy E had that. So, you know, that would make Easy E the realest, actually, because he had the worst. Easy didn't know he had it, though. When they told Easy he had it, he, he was said, on No, way. I don't. He was on hey, you know what I'm saying? He said, What? It was they so told, new. When they told Easy he had AIDS, he's like, I ain't no faggot. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. But he did tell the world as soon as he found out. I'm pretty, sure, I'm pretty sure before he caught AIDS, he had herpes. It's like the gateway. Anyway, like gateway. If you get herpes, He said AIDS what he had next. right away as soon as he found out. Like, he released a statement. Would I he didn't know that whole herpes? time, but when he found out, he made his statement about Hell it. So yeah. everybody knew, and then he died. I had rubber gloves yeah. on, though. I beat his ass. He, caught, he found <laughs> out, like, immediately. Beat his ass with some surgical gloves on. Uh, that's so sad. It make me think about the movie, and I'ma cry. Anyways, we got our celebrity topics. Let me get off into these. Rest in peace, Easy E. Where the freaky ass. So King of Diamonds is officially closing. Yeah, you guys I can no that. longer go evicted. there to see asses. King of Diamonds closed, y'all. And they mm -hmm. got evicted. 
Damn. Where's y'all gonna miss them all? Miami. Is y'all gonna miss them all? I thought it was one in Atlanta. It's one in Miami. The one they talking about is in Miami. Oh. The one in Miami called? Yeah, that's they got What the big. fuck? That's Trick Daddy Daddy. Y'all know that, right? Man, what the no, fuck? I didn't. Yeah, that own it. That's Trick Daddy Pops that own that club. Um, Whoa, King of Diamonds. Right, nigga hurt me. Y'all know he did. And they told him he, he died. Boy, shut up. Easy was murdered. Oh, here you go. Sick of you. Listen, I kind of agree you with you. You them I niggas. Done, I done watched them conspiracy interviews. You one of them niggas that really thought Jack okay, Down died, it. man. I'm sick of you. I believe it. You really think Jack and Down died too, huh? I don't believe that. <laughs> you better cut, cut it out, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways, at a recent Pusha T show, um, the Rest tech man and put Happy Fuck birthday. Drake on <laughs> the, the big screen behind him, and Pusha T actually stopped the show because he said that that wasn't something that he, like, told them to do or planned to do. He said the tech guy just kind of, like, you know, took it into his own hands type shit. Oh, yeah, he got fired. <laughs> And he made a statement like, I wouldn't do no shit like that. He was like, when I say something, I'm, it's going to come out of my mouth and it's going to be direct. So, like, that was out there. 147 at Halstead. What? I was reading that. Who addresses that? That's, that's Chicago. Anyways. You ain't got no comments on your face? Mm, I saw that. Oh. He handled it the right way. He did. He definitely did. Waka Flocka made a... um video today like on his snapchat where he basically said that he's going to follow the trend and end all of his beefs with people and he like suggested that all rappers need to do that now because like it's just that time for everybody to be on that and he reached out to gucci man because i guess like they've been having like a year's feud i don't know nothing about none of that but do you who is yeah, akinelli they've been beefing akinelli what are they beefing for KLD, who is that remember put it in your mouth no remember that song sport uh-uh. Put, put it, in, it your in your mouth. You remember that song back in the day? Who is it uh-uh. by? Akinelli. Oh. Who? And what? I thought so because I thought Gucci Mane. Um, That's his name too. Yeah, that. That's his name What's too. her name? What was they beefing for? I don't know. I forgot what they beef was you all know? about. That money. Yeah, something. I think it was about some money. But ain't wasn't she still his manager or what? He fired her. Who Gucci? Yeah, didn't yeah, he have Waka Flocka Mama as his manager? For a while, but he been done. He been, he been gone from dead. For a while. She said, who was Flocka? <laughs> Don't do Flocka like that. Flocka! What? Don't do him that way. I agree, though. I think all of the rappers need to be on that now. Y'all old. Times is changing. And these young niggas is on some different stuff, so y'all need to. Checking for Flocka wife. Said we checking for Flock of Wife more than we checking for him. Hoes love Dipset. No, we said Jules was missing Somebody his teeth and Hoes still like them. He ain't really missing his teeth. That's what 50 That's Cent said. 50 Cent is full of shit. He say a lot of stuff. You listening to that man yeah, now? Yeah, because some of that shit be. be true. You bet not be. On what? Well, yeah, now he is. Some of that shit 50 be, sure. be true. And be a young boy, the realest. He going to keep on saying that. Well, I say 21 Savage is the realest. Just recently, he gave $50,000 to a little girl um, who's one of his, like, number one fans with cancer. He went and he paid off, like, her medical bills and stuff for her mom. So a shout-out and salute to him for that. I've always loved 21 Savage. Is he going to tell everybody that Amber Rose gave him herpes? Amber Rose ain't give him herpes. Why do you be on that with everybody now? Leave people alone, Okay. That's not okay to just start rumors like that. I know. I know what to look for now. <sighs> I know what to look for now. I can tell if you got herpes. How how can you tell? It's by the ear. It's by the ear. What's and wrong if with you that got ear? A, and if you got a severe, a severe case of herpes, I can tell by the voice. He is. It's herpes everywhere. What does a herpes voice sound like, Spoiled? Say something again. You been. <laughs> <No. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> I can't stand you. Takashi 6 9 Y'all spelt that wrong, but. Anyways, because he's so irritating. Well, speaking of Takashi, since they just brought him up, he has a new record that he's been like Let taunting about. Let me finish. Usher did tell motherfuckers he had herpes. He got a new. 
um, record with Nicki Minaj, Lil Baby, Tory Lanez, A Boogie, Gunna, whoever Annual is. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Ooh, the earwax. And Bobby Schmurter. Hit him with that earwax. They jump. Ooh, she burning, burning. I saw that too. Scott Storch needs to get his life together. He has? (laughs) Since when? (laughs) Y'all crazy, yo. I can't deal with them. You the one who mentioned him and keep putting rainbows with his name. Hell yeah. Y'all do know the earwax trick, right? If you don't know the earwax. Yeah, we put we y'all on the line a couple episodes ago. If she burn and hit her with the Why? earwax before you go in there, she jumps. First of all, that just seems you gross jump. to be doing in the first place. So who thinks to stick some earwax up somebody? That is disgusting. You get Breeze. it on your fingertip. You don't really put Listen, it up Listen, you're putting it on Breeze your finger like and <laughs> sticking <laughs> it on somebody. And then you put it down there. Bree oh, sound man. like somebody with that severe. <laughs> I'm going to knock you out. That just like, seems I only gross. Use Maybe lamb. that's just angry. I only question. use lamb skins. Most people that with severe You sound like them hoes. <laughs> <laughs> I hate him. Severe herpes makes you very angry. Anyways, yeah, Kim yeah, and yeah, Kanye... Saved 15 homes in the recent California wildfires they because they hired they hired <laughs> private firefighters for their house and their neighborhood. Let me see the lighting. That was my question. I didn't know private firefighters existed. California got all kind of shit. Let me see the lighting. People make up any oh, way. I Listen. mean, they saved other people's houses for free. So, I mean, they were just trying to do something nice, like, that they could do, you know? But they helped other people. They saved a total of 15 homes. And a lot of celebrities lost their homes in them wildfires. So, yeah. All right. I'm trying to clean up. I don't need no damn nap. I'm turning clean up. We're going to find out who got that hidden yeah. herb, though. Oh, what? Only lamb skins. skins on my mama. <laughs> them hoes. She was sounding like one of them. Like, mm-mm, that be irritating. Uh, gonna kill Latex a nigga. be irritating. Going to kill a nigga with what that What are y'all skin. talking about? Okay? I, about, th- like, y'all is irritating me at this point. What the hell? JJ, what it do, my nigga? We talking about that pussy. That's what we Stop talking about. Stop saying that word. OTF. Share that shit this episode 53, my G. And shout out to all our sponsors. And NBA Youngboy, the realest rapper, because he let every motherfucker know he got that hinderp. Niggas ain't going to come out to clinize it like then that. And he I ain't even old eight. enough to get in the club, and he had his baby in the club with him. He realer than all you niggas. Dog, a young nigga. Oh, my mom. Young nigga with big hinderp. Big hit nerd, big hit nerd in his blood. And every bitch in the club. But he was real still, though. And every bitch was still trying to jump. And he got that bag though. Big hurt, big hurt in his blood. And every bitch was still trying to jump. Breakouts in nine in, in nine in though. <laughs> Some fucking patrol. What he don't need. Oh, oh my lord. <laughs> I cannot deal with him today. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Hey. Y'all, y'all he is crying. Y'all introduced <laughs> to Scales new shit, man. The nigga done snuck and did some motherfucking <laughs> mercy video shit, man. Fuck this video, my nigga. Is this Viper Visions? Get your, get right? your stuff together. Uh, this is from the first man, Samusa. Damn, this shit old. This okay, shit kind of old. It ain't that old, spoil, oh. but it's kind of old. But I finally got a visual to uh, this record called Mission Statement. So y'all let me know what y'all think. Shout out to the homie Viper Visions. He shot this. So I, It's going to be on YouTube Thursday. So I wanted to premiere it first here on Smoking Gossip. So y'all man, check play it that, out. Run that video, my nigga. It's levels to the shit, young boy. Tone. Uh. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Uh oh. Man, so who's the heart? 
I'm clear why I'm here, how about you? I'm on a mission, I know what I gotta do Man a Musa, king like Martin Luther A peaceful black man, but I ride with them shooters That's just the climbing in my environment Every day I'm around more heat than a fireman Fresh out the frying pan into the fire Y'all rather be the user, I'd rather be the supplier The devil is a liar, I pray every day At the Gucci store, the only time I see snakes Niggas so fake Gotta hold them up to the light like you do money when it don't look right Try to stay out of sight, out of mind But the grind keeps me forever on a mind And that's cool, it's the life I chose The price of fame costs more than a bankroll Almost lost my life, trying to find myself Said fuck a deal, and I signed myself Had to check myself and get a check myself Before I wreck myself, uh Health is wealth, rich man told me that, uh Add it up, do the math on that, uh Facts I'm the shit the game been missing. Complete fucking opposite of all this fiction. Hold up. This one radio DJ all in his emotions Cause I was joking about janky promotion Relax, it happens to the best of us What makes you any different than the rest of us? When a comedian roasted me, I just laughed And said thanks, you got me more fans Listen fam, just hold your L's like I do It's a part of life, it's called survival And this ain't no diss, no idols become rivals I don't hold grudges, I ain't spiteful Bible, this is real talk, only fake get offended by real talk, tried to squash the beef with Reek, he's still mad I might eat a little pussy, don't kiss no ass Only positive vibes, I'm just trying to feed my seed and live my life uh, More life, more success, uh, that's all I want until my last breath on my deathbed Come smoke with me, and then build a statue in the middle of the city I'm trying to leave a legacy and make history I'm in competition with nobody but me Trying to be a better me than I was last night Cause last night could have been my last night Hold up Scales done dipped off and dropped a motherfucking banger. No, I ain't playing with That's banging. like a year old, you know what I'm saying? My guy shoot great videos. Appreciate it. Shout out Viper Visions for that. It'll be on YouTube Thursday. So make sure y'all be ready for the premiere of that. Let us know what y'all think in the comments. I know y'all caught a few of them bars. Look at Red. Look at Reddy. He on our ass. Right. What, what do we do? Yeah, a little commercial video on the call. That, yeah, that was it. Show people, you know, I still got this shit. You know what I'm saying? It's more to come, though. Where, Me and Viper, we working. Oh, so it's more coming. Right. Brina said, okay, Scales. Appreciate it, Tamika. Okay, thank we you, see you, LaDonna. Scales. I don't want to hit it with the we you. see you. Thank you. I think ours okay, is coming later than Scales. Scales. Yeah. Okay, he might eat a little pussy, but he don't kiss no ass. I know, caught that one, right? That's the one that stood out. Hey, Y'all missed the see. That was the the, the uh the uh Facebook edited version. <laughs> it said I might eat a little pussy, little booty, but I don't eat, kiss no <laughs> ass. <Say that>. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot deal. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh shit. That's singing in the end. I don't know why I, could, I couldn't get Beyonce, <laughs> man, for the shit. video. You know what I'm saying? Baby was busy. You know what I mean? You Sand said baby. Yeah, Sandeep keep calling me ho. Why well, Beyonce didn't oh, sing? I was about to say. Oh shit! You think you slick, scale? <laughs> Rich kid, get on my <laughs> nerves. You ain't slick. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see the rest of that. Oh, right. For sure, you spoke. Yeah, was a slip one in on. Nice. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. 
Spoil needs some milk, yeah, to go with that Patron. I don't drink milk. He, I done took it. It's confiscated. Yeah, back. <laughs> shit, pass me the bottle. Uh, <laughs> no, just take this. Yeah, give me my shit now. Fuck, <laughs> right, <laughs> man, you got me fucked clean up. What? Our guest said they're about five minutes away, I think. Yeah, we got to be ready for our guest. You ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dope video. Don't appreciate that, y'all. That's what's up, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all show us love. We show y'all love. Throw any parties, we there. I ain't been having as no long visuals, as we free. man. So people been on my ass about having this music and not having no visuals. So I got to get on my visual game. You should do like a documentary video thing. Oh, you yeah. should do one of those all with your is, album. All like just put the, all the songs. All like. that's in the works. You oh, reading our mind, bro. Yeah, he, 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 he think he hot. yo. Wait, yeah. wait till you hear my verse. Hey, don't, don't, don't behave like that. Wait till you hear my verse. I'm about, about to go in there and kill you, wait boy. Till you verse. Hear my verse. Remember that? What was that on that Mike Jones movie? Yeah, what he said. I'm finna no, kill so I'm about you to go in there and kill, kill you, boys. Verse. verse. <laughs> get his studio dropping already. Don't see, Good yeah, looking, that shit right. I'm about to go in there and kill you, boy. Versus. Good Skills looking, is man. That shit was hard. Appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it. That's gonna make a mess. But we ain't, but we ain't, but we ain't feeling that shit because it ain't real as that NBA young boy. Skills ain't come out and say. <laughs> I got the gout. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He ain't come out to tell niggas he got the gout. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck no. Scales ain't the realest. That shit was hard. But NBA <laughs> young boy is the realest. <laughs> <coughs> Bro, you can hate all you want. But all the right, realest nigga ever good. just graced this motherfucking stomping ground. The, as we call the 414. What's that in trail? Man, all right. Yeah, I got them boys, but <laughs> I'm about to go let them the boys realest. in. The realest, man. I can't okay. The realest, my nigga. Today. I'm starting to think you got the hurt. You got me fucked up. <laughs> I can't deal with y'all today. See, don't play with me like that. Because you know I be ribbing and shit. I be having to think about... What I say before I say it, cause I just come out with ribs. So don't play with me like that. He finna start <laughs> ribbing. Leave this no. man alone. Lead I'm not gonna alone. rib, but you know what I'm saying. I can get ready to <laughs> if need be. Shut up. He said I can get ready to. <laughs> Y'all better stop provoking this man today. Hey, he done drank too scales much. Scales got the gout, y'all. And this he motherfucker, doesn't. Scales got the gout. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker ain't keeping that shit a thaw wild with Please. you people. A wild. Mm-hmm. I can't stand him. Bree Trill. When I first met Bree, she was like, Spoil, he beat me. <laughs> and we got her out of that abusive relationship. <laughs> I'm done with sports today. <laughs> Completely done. Uh, hit the uh, hit hit Doc inbox. He gonna tell you, bro. Sean, I said Sean Shannon. That wasn't number uh hand sanitizer. Listen, Who purse? Okay. Oh, he, he acting a whole I just be, ass, I just, huh? and I cannot deal with him. Boy, well, I need your cup and blunt. Just know, just know that cup full of that motherfucking shit and this blunt full of that gas, my nigga. Pray for him. <laughs> yeah. Pray for him. That's what he If you try that needs. rib shit. He talking about ribbing. You really people. get to. If somebody says something to him, he talking about ribbing. <laughs> like, just get him together. Please <laughs> get him together. <laughs> yeah, he don't play that shit in the comments. He ain't letting shit slide. <laughs> oh, hell no. He ain't letting shit slide. This is at what all. He on y'all ass. Pray for him. On a DUI. <laughs> Pray for him. Pray for him. I'm telling you. He needs something. Uh, oh, they said folks go get a DUI. Man, right. All right. Man, we got we got two before we bring out the crew, you hear me? What DJ Mom was bros. I what DJ was I talking about? I'm talking about no DJ. Huh? Right. <coughs> DJ was, yeah, DJ Jazzy Jeff, Jazzy motherfucker. Jeff. DJ Jazzy Jeff. In a session. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? <coughs> Y'all ready? Yes, we are ready. Okay. Drum roll. Drum roll. 
coming to the stage in my Reggie Brown voice. Coming to the stage. <laughs> we got the mud bros, baby. Yeah, we got young poppy knees, shooter and B in the building. Here we go. What it do? What it do? Fresh what off the do? NBA young boy. One of y'all can grab reposition. a chair. What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, they deep. So we got to. What's going on, baby? We all settled. Everybody has a mic. The end, Doc. Yeah, okay. All right. So, first, everybody introduce yourself. I'm Young Poppy. I'm Shooter MB. And I'm Knees. And together? Mud Brothers. <laughs> okay, and how long have each of y'all been doing music? I've been doing music since December of 15. That's when I uh, first started taking some interest. And then I went to jail, you know what I mean? Like August of uh, 16, <coughs> I did a two-year bid, you know what I'm saying? And shit, you know, I'm back. Okay. I'm, I've been out for about 40 days. You know what I'm saying? I got released uh, from Flambeau, uh, correctional, I mean, yeah, correctional, uh, September, you know what I mean? Okay. September 10th, 2018, of course, you know what I'm saying? I've been out 40 days, so now, you know. Okay, welcome home. Yes, bless, yeah. bless, bless. Right. I've been Ready doing music. <laughs> I started doing music around the same time, around December. Well, that's, I started taking it serious last year, though, so, yeah, so. Around like two years ago. I started doing music about man. About him sliding. About twenty eleven, man. Um fucking around with my my brothers and them, you know, just doing shit. It sounded good, so I just stuck with it, kept doing the shit. Okay. Yeah. That's what it do. I uh I was uh fucking with uh Reek uh my loud crib and he had played some of y'all music. And I was like, damn, that shit bumped. He was like, these my artists. And I'm like, okay, yeah, that shit hard. He was like, I was like, let me hear that shit. He was playing this shit off this phone. He got to pulling up videos and shit. And uh, y'all had this one shit with Chapo. And I think y'all did one with Luke. Did y'all do one with both of them? Or just yeah, we got something with both of them. You got, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Because he played, he played a couple of them, like, by y'all, by y'all self. But then he, he, got a, he got a single with... Uh, well, uh, chop up called dog food. Oh, okay. okay. That's the video we got. <laughs> okay, well, tell us a little bit about that because we wanted to play that um, music video today. Um, so, how basically, how about? that came together, uh, I recently made that song. It was just my two verses on there, but uh, I knew that for my project, I needed some mm -hmm. some big names on my on my tape. So, I just went down the list and Chop up Ben saying he wanted to like work with me. So, I was like, that'll fit him perfect. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So, I really just feel like he'll fit that. Yeah, fit in, and, cause like my music ain't really Milwaukee-ish, you know what I'm saying? So that was like the closest song I feel like he could adapt to, that he could clean, you know what I'm saying? Just, just when you say it, it's not Milwaukee, how would you describe your music? Cause Milwaukee kind of got like a Detroit sound, you know what I'm saying? But like me, I'm more like uh, what I could industry. I'm like industry, you know what I'm saying? So okay. yeah. Who are your influences then? Before we get into this, yours uh, specifically. My, my favorite rappers is Lil Wayne. That's my favorite rapper. And then I like uh, Lil Durk. That's okay. my second. So uh, and then Rich Homie Quan. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then we can show that video, Doc, when you're ready. Shorty so damn bad that she deserve a ring But I probably won't cuff 
I should have changed my ways. I was here protected, but I skipped the day. I'm Mr. J. My lawyer need a pillow, he gon' be that case. We big dogs, and you little niggas just some lower case. Trip like a yacht, work my way right to the top. And I showed it to your mama, man, I pray that she don't drop. I got dog food, you ain't know a nigga say you're them pests. I break all rules, and the nigga only fuck with them vests. I got hotties on my neck, I got hotties on my neck. I don't care about the price, I'ma buy it off the strength. I'ma call my nigga you streets with that dog and I'm gonna glit. When they call me people, the way I'm getting checks. I got dog food, you ain't know a nigga say you're them pests. I break all rules, and the nigga only fuck with them vests. Hit it with a skirt, skirt, Michael just step on it. Now I don't know her name, but this dick, she made a mess on it. This is worth 200 for the users. Better hide your bitch, she's a chooser. I got grits for the 60, but that hit stuff on it. Bobby got the Mac 11 with the cooler kid. Yeah, Bobby, though. Pull him like it's lace, like what's up with this? I'm crusty crabs with the formula, I got the mix. Formula, hey, it's big chop on that nigga now. Big chop. Booked all month, we can't kick it now. I got my heart broke once, I got no feelings left. No, bitch. Need a rapper, sell a dog food, I'm on the way to make it up. I got dog food, you ain't know a nigga say you're them pets. I break all rules, and the nigga only fuck with them vets. I got hotties on my neck, I got hotties on my neck. I don't care about the price, I'ma buy it off the strength. I'ma call my nigga you streets with that dog, and I'm gonna glit. When they call me people, the way I'm getting checks. I got dog food, you ain't know a nigga say you're them pets. I break Won't pay for that pussy no. Don't open that door Cause right now I'm smoking cookie no. Got a bad bitch with me If she ain't fucking Then I'm out of here I'm addicted to the dick I think that bitch done stole my underwear yeah. Naturally I'm a boss I just play my role yeah, Got on all fours She finna snatch my soul Real I remember all them days I was on the road yeah, And if the police let them lights I put it in a hole I never met this bitch I'm wondering how she remember me how? Poppy killed this beat I swear to God that it's a casualty wow. If she hold it down be a better me. Yeah. That's just say the least. I bet you wondering how I really got this cheese. I got dog food. You ain't know a nigga say you're them pets. I break all rules. And the nigga only fuck with them vets. I got hotties on my neck. I got hotties on my neck. I don't care about the price. I'ma buy it off the strength. I'ma call my nigga you streets with that dog. And I'm gonna glit. When they call me people, the way I'm getting checks. I got dog food. You ain't know a nigga say you're them pets. I break Flames, they fucking with a young poppy. Flame, flame, flame. We back, Doc. Yep, we back. Yeah, that was the homie Young Poppy featuring Guapo Chapo right there. And we Dog can see y'all comments now, so let us know what y'all think. Yeah, let me know what y'all let me know what y'all think about that right there. Okay. And in the works right now, what are you guys working on right now? Right now we should we just working on um, I got this Greta trial right here. You know, this just came out a few days ago. Young Poppy Real will be coming out um, November 15th. Shooter shit um, coming out December. I'm not I'm not quite sure what he what he titling it right now, but we working on it. You know what I'm saying? We got over 50 tracks, you know, recorded, ready to go right now. You know, so that's what's up. You know, and we gonna have a compilation drop start. in uh, mm-hmm. the beginning just of the year, start. around like Valentine's Day. We are gonna have a compilation of us three working on some shit. So. That's what's like up. So, so y'all called the Mud Brothers as a collective. No, we a label. That's, that's, that's the regular. label. That's the regular, regular label. We all solo. We not. We not no group. Oh, okay. Right. We we not no group. I'm. A, we all solo artists. Yeah. Okay. We not no group. You yeah, know. So when they performed, they they uh they yeah. was doing separate separate songs. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay. okay. Right. Most definitely. Most Speaking definitely. of the performance, I'm happy Spool brought that up. Give us what y'all thought about yesterday. Me. That's my first show. Okay. So. <laughs> You know, I was amped. This is my first show. I was, you know, I was screaming. Yeah. I was screaming in the mic. Everybody, everybody saying I did a good job. I had the crowd going, but I was screaming in the mic. This is my first performance. You know what I mean? Like, he like did shit. good though. He did yeah, good. It's all, it's was all about the experience. I had, good, I had good stage. You know what yeah. I mean? Presence. You know, they really was fucking with me. I had, I, yeah, I had a, I, I had a little dude come up to me like, man, you my hero. So shit, like, yeah. right, man, you know what I mean? No, that's Took a picture yeah. with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit. So it was shit. good vibes, though. It was good vibes. That's what's Fuck up. what a hater got to say, man. Right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they like that. They, they said it's fire. Yeah, they fucking with it. That's what's up. That's what's up, y'all. 
But uh, I, what I think of the performance, I think it was uh, I think it was straight. You know what I'm saying? Crowd. You know how Milwaukee is, anyways. Though you know what I'm saying? Like they gotta really, really, really fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? But. It was fun. Yeah, they gotta know the song. Yeah, they gotta know the song. And then all them songs, all these songs that we performed yesterday, nobody knew. Yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. I feel it was like. All it's, new. it's brand new. They was rocking with but us. Nobody I was knew. looking in the crowd. They was rocking yeah. with us. They just ain't know the song. Yeah, it was yeah, all unreleased shit. It was. it was all unreleased music. So. Yeah, that's what it was. Like, because the only people that really showed love to, love to, was um, uh, Jig, because the, uh, they yeah. knew that they knew the fuck out uh, that, that uh, ball for no reason. They knew that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Chicken. We up next. Yeah, they, knew they got that cracking taco song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. they yeah. most definitely had the crowd rocking with them. Yeah. Most definitely, they, they did their thing. Uh, you know, like them songs was already like in the streets moving yeah. and grooving. So you know, once you get your song moving and grooving in the streets, then it's yeah. easy to perform it around that it's crowd. crowd. It's a hood yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's a hood anthem already. Yeah. So shit, like shit. Yeah. You know, it was easy for them to young men get up there and do their thing because the, the crowd knew the song. Shout out you know Chicken Will. He said dope shit, y'all. Most definitely. Show, do y'all show. plan to do like more live shows like that, live concert performances? Most like definitely. That? We got uh, yeah. we got Draco and Bino coming up on uh, December twenty third. You know, at Lavish. Okay. So okay. that might be our soonest performance. You know. Okay. okay. Mm hmm. Most definitely. Okay. Club performance is always cracking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got a show on the eighteenth at the Mimar Theater. Okay. I think. And then I got a uh, show then, huh? Tuesday. I forgot where it's at. Though. I don't know. Are y'all supposed to be having this so people can know how to find <laughs> yeah. y'all? Really oh, you gotta just follow me on Instagram. Up. You follow me on Instagram. <laughs> I post all the flyers and shit. Yeah. I also, uh, I'm also having a release party on November 17th that y'all welcome to come to. 8:30, 8:30 to um 10 o'clock. Where yeah, can we like confirm well. all this information? What's all y'all social oh. media handles? We need all. Uh, of you that. can follow me on Instagram at Young Poppy Baby. I'm on Facebook as Young Poppy. Twitter is Young Poppy MKE. I don't be on there like that though, but you know how that is. <laughs> you can follow me on Instagram at The Real Shooter MB. That's the only page I'm working with right now. Yeah. And then you can follow me on Knees on Murder on Facebook, and then Knees on Murder on um, Instagram, and then our YouTube page is called Mud Brothers Mud Bros Music Groups. You know what I'm saying? M U D D B R O S Music Group. Okay. That's how you can find our. You know what I mean? Okay. Exclusive. <laughs> I don't know, Pops. Sure. That's why. Look, he on your head. That's my nigga, too, hey. bro. <laughs> NBA young boy still the realest rapper, man. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga told motherfuckers he got herpes, man. They motherfuckers ain't coming out telling motherfuckers they got herpes, bro. <laughs> Straight up, bro. Just, nigga, he the realest, the my nigga. Mike is that nigga. Yeah. Straight up, my nigga. <laughs> motherfuckers ain't coming out like that, bro. Mike is that nigga. I just had to put that in there, man. Y'all no, said whatever Mike he sound checked yeah. with. Yeah. Don't give me that. Don't give me that, that don't make him the hardest Niggas or the realest. <laughs> Everybody ball. ain't got herpes. Everybody they don't have to come out and say they got herpes. They say they say one out of one out of three people got that <laughs> shit, dog. Niggas don't say, baby. You might boss me in. I cannot deal with him. I cannot deal with him. So we got another. So we got another video. We gonna yeah. show it is right. Tell us about that one. Um, this is what you do to me. You know what I mean? Me and me and bro just got in the lab, and you know, I feel like I feel like bro the goat. When y'all hear this shit, it's on a whole nother way. I feel like shooter, he the goat, man. I ain't gonna even lie. When y'all when y'all hear this shit, when y'all hear his new shit, man, it's gonna take over the streets. I feel like I'm just shit putting in an introduction for him. You know what I mean? <laughs> he, de he definitely the new way. Definitely the new one, way. I, I really, you know what I mean? That's my boy, for real. For sure. He for sure, you know what I'm saying? Okay. When he come out, he for sure make a heavy noise. Heavy noise. I'm just kicking the door open for him. Let's get it. Fly Melodies. I'm new to me. I don't do that usually, but I'm a nigga two or three. Pop the lils in that one righteousness. Pop me a perk and my eyes went dead. Pulled a couple lines, now where's my bed? Got a little pussy, now where's the head? Found us a plug, now where it is. So we taking off like a legit thing. Nothing in the hand, I gotta buy some tracks. Feel like Santa Claus with this big backpack. Cutting what you do to me. 
I follow script usually. Taking perks back to back, we finna start a pharmacy. Get a nigga whack while I be someone sippin' all of me. Knees up in the back, he keep on itching, perk is calling me. What them balls that we need them all, yeah, we lookin'. Been sippin' raw up in the kitchen while we cookin' Them niggas over there having a hard time pushing. They find they dope hard, they having a hard time cooking, yeah Our beans red a wheelie from the scene Stretchin' that RDA mean fella We all about green fella You see the MB necklace I tell you we out the mud Ain't nobody gave us nothing And we had to find ourselves a club, yeah Fuck the deuce, we pourin' foes and double cups, yeah Fuck poppin' too, we poppin' four, we throwin' up, yeah This shit's so good and I can feel it in my gut, yeah These niggas playin', I'ma have they ass touch, yeah Time to mass up, knees get to top We gon' tear the city up from top to bottom We gon' run the tickets up, take care of mamas We gon' buy a mansion with six car garages And they all better be Bentley's in that bitch, nigga we ain't leaving no witness in that bitch, nigga. If she ain't fine, then I ain't tipping that little bitch, nigga. And this ain't one that I'm sipping on the bitch, nigga. I pour the deuce and now I'm tripping like a bitch, nigga. Cody, what you do to me? Perky, what you do to me? Tiny, that's so new to me. I don't do that usually, but I'ma need two or three. Cody, what you do to me? Perky, what you do to me? That's how new to me I don't do that usually But I'm a nigga two or three I'm going to tell you like this. <laughs> Come on, Big Mike. Man, we need you. Views, yeah, he just did 1.3. I know, that's what I'm saying. Come on, Mike, man. We need you on here, nigga. They said you need some coffee, fam. Who said that? You. <laughs> you need some. Letitia. <coughs> Letitia. Yeah, so that was knees, real shooter no, right there. You better, you better not rib nobody. Back on up. Don't rib nobody. <laughs> you don't know how to behave. Well, Shooter, we didn't ask you, like, your influences and whatnot, and because you were just in this video, like, tell us a little bit more about you and the projects you have coming yeah, up. Yeah, ask Shooter some questions. Oh, uh, man, I got, um, I got a tape dropping on. I, I'm, I'm undecided right now on the, on, the, on, the, on the title. I should... On what I should name it, but man, it's it's in the, it's it's damn near done and in the in the work, man. So shit, y'all be looking forward to it. Okay, well, um, you not done? Uh -uh. <laughs> so what can we expect from yours? Man, yeah, he trying to get rid of the mic. Oh, what can shit, we expect man, from I'm it? <laughs> Tell us a little bit about it. Who influences you? We need all that. Man, my brothers influenced me to do That's this shit. Tip. You know, like. I really, I really, you know, I ain't got the drive for it, but they, they, they make me do this shit, so I'm, I'm, I'm rocking with it. You know, I know, I know you're rocking with it. Hey, but, hey, that's how no, sometimes you need shit. that, the yeah. Nigga, the nigga who don't want to rap, that nigga the man called this, yeah. 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 I'm rocking with it, man. So man. you believe it or not, that's a lot of people's story. You know what I'm saying? I done heard that story a lot. Like, man, I ain't even Jeezy. That was a lot of people's story. Like, man, I ain't even really want to do this shit for real. But bro, now, you see what I'm saying? Like, so. I, I know he's a lot of people's story. I got him 100%. 100%. I got him. Sure, this is crazy, though. I feel like we the most talented in Milwaukee right now. Mm. They the most talented. Y'all heard it here first. Yeah. That's, that's what's like, up. Bro, bro got that oh, he need a mic. Give him a mic. Give him a mic. Give him a mic. Bro, bro, knees killing it right now with that. With that. Nobody got a better Detroit sound than he got. No, 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 you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm saying, when you just disrespected me with that one, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. They say he like the shooter, like the take off of the group. I barely listen to you. I ain't got no talent. No, this is what I'm saying. I ain't trying to. I ain't gonna lie, bro. No. I'm the one that took you to the bone, Grissom. I'm the one that took you to the bone, Grissom. I'm saying that. I'm saying that. That sound. I wanted to say something when you said it the first time, man. We don't got no. I don't got no Detroit sound, man. Obviously, you just played. We just played that. What you do to me? I don't sound shit like I, no. I fuck with Detroit music. Don't get me wrong, but 
We got our own flavor, my nigga. Now. You misunderstood it's, me, man. No, <laughs> I, I didn't. I didn't. Hey, you misunderstood me. Said, you got you got know how to comprehend. You got know That's how to comprehend. That's what we on on here, so you know. Yeah, my shit Milwaukee, bro. Like I said, I ain't, I'm not I'm not even known that shit because we bringing some niggas from Detroit up here. You know what I mean? <laughs> Drake on being though they from Detroit. Oh, they cool. Like, they yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah, like, like, yeah, like, like, yeah, no, they like, not a game. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm, I'm rocking and rolling, but shit, you know, <laughs> most definitely, this, this ain't no Detroit sound right here. So, shit, you know, you my brother and all that, but no, shit, I, no, gotta, I feel what you're saying. I feel what you're saying. No, like, you got, you got plenty, you got plenty salt. You just, you just ain't comprehended how I wanted you to. Yeah. What I want, I what I was think, saying is when you when you own that when you own that lane, you the best at it. That's what I was saying. Bro. I mean, I, mean, I respect that, but I'm I'm in my own. Yeah, lane. You, I ain't you in no Detroit lane. I'm a, I'm gonna keep it high with you, shit. This, shit. Like, see, right. do y'all feel me though? Yeah, I feel. You feel me. Yeah, because my shit don't Detroit sound like no. Yeah, us, that's not a Detroit sound because that's a that's a. It's, uh, it's cultural now in Milwaukee. It's, it's cultural now. And a Cali. Yeah, in the Bay Area they do it too. They do it too in the Bay Area. All I'm saying is, man. I've been rapping how I've been rapping since I started rapping. <laughs> if that makes any sense, goddamn it. Before yeah. I even heard anybody, I was, you know what I mean? Before I even heard, any, you know what I mean, any Detroit rap. I've been rapping like this since I was 13, 14 years old. You know what I mean? So it most definitely ain't no Detroit, you know what I'm saying, sound or influence. I fuck with them cats, don't, don't get me wrong. Man, y'all just heard that shit that it sound Detroit? Y'all definitely don't sound like Detroit for sure, but Shooter exactly. still ain't tell us yeah, what we could expect man. from his album. He hurried up and gave that mic up. Oh, shit, man. Y'all can expect just shit me. I'm, I'm, <laughs> y'all can expect me right, shit. Right, down there quiet. Y'all can like, expect like me because shit, I, I, I'm really, <laughs> I ain't really trying to do too many features or none of that mm -hmm. shit because I'm just trying to get y'all me real quick and let y'all, you know. Decide, you know. Okay, you gonna do some like more videos in the future, anything yeah, I, like that? Yeah, I'm gonna do a lot of videos, a lot of videos coming. Okay. I'm telling y'all when, when it, you know what I mean? When he get his spot, he most definitely gonna take off. He That's most what's definitely up. gonna take off. I feel like if I never go to jail, we'd be gone already. That's just how I feel. I ain't gonna lie because shit, when I went to jail, it seemed like like the like the mud brother movement kind of slowed down. Like you know. Mud brothers and out the mud are two different things. We, yeah. you know, that's some, that's some whole other, that's some whole other shit, you know. But you know, that's, that that used to be the movement, right? So I feel like shit, nigga, slow down when I went to jail. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm back. You know what I'm saying? That's what's up. Like shit. So from y'all collectively, what can we expect like for 2019 or even the rest of this year? It's short, but what y'all got coming up? Yeah, in the future. We got we got a, a mixtape dropping every month. I'm gonna make sure of it. If, okay. if I gotta drop the motherfucker every month. Y'all did hit to some month. shows too, right? Shows? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some shows was coming up, right, too? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got, uh, we got that Drago and uh, Bino coming. What, okay. what date is that? December 23rd. December 23rd. December 23rd. Okay. December 23rd lavish. So lavish. That's going to okay. be lit. Uh, November 18th, we're going to be at the Meemar Theater, me and these. Okay. So you can expect us there. And then uh, I got that Poppy World dropping November 15th. Uh, 14 okay. songs. All hits, all good music. Y'all gonna fuck with that, so that's all right. coming, so. Shit, but well, before we let y'all go, please get y'all social media handles again and make sure people can find out where they can get this music from. You know what I'm saying? So each okay. one of y'all give up y'all social medias where people can access y'all and then let them know where they can get the music. Y'all can follow me at The Real Shooter, MB. You can follow me on Instagram at Young Poppy Baby. And I'm on Facebook as Young Poppy. My Facebook is Knees on Murder. And my Instagram is Knees on Murder. N E E Z underscore O M E R T A. And the YouTube. And the YouTube is M U D D Bros Music Group. Okay. And the music is available on all social platforms like iTunes, Tidal, and all streaming, streaming sites. Everywhere. Okay. Apple Music, everywhere. Spotify, anywhere you can stream music. That's our music is there. And then you can get the hard copies with Big Unk on 14th, right? 14th and Northfield, Godfather Electronics. Oh. Yeah, everything you need. Y'all better get on it. Support y'all um, local artists before they blow up without y'all. Y'all for sure gonna be seeing more of us. Mm -hmm. Most definitely. We appreciate y'all coming through, man. Mm -hmm. It's the mud, bro. Y'all. Love, y'all. Sure, we really love appreciate y'all. You, you know, welcome, up, welcome us on here. You know what I'm saying? That's 100. Yep. Y'all gonna have to come back. 
Yep. Yeah, we definitely come back. Yep. Yep, yep. Yeah, we're going to drop the project. Yep, yep, yep. for sure, for sure. All right. Like, our blessing going to be hard because all of us got talent for sure, you know? That's what's up. Well, everybody give us our little um, three minutes so we can reposition again. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so yeah. we appreciate y'all, man. That's love, baby. Well, I appreciate it. Oh. appreciate Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, we need to pick the record, y'all. Y'all know how this goes. Excuse us. <laughs> right, we got to take a picture real quick. <laughs> we slid the table back. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Uh, man, it's horrible. Because the people usually drop that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Lift it up a little bit. Okay. All right, y'all. We're in our last final five minutes. Any closing thoughts? What was funny? What we do? Listen, he got real, real. (laughs) Okay. I felt like we was caught in the middle. I was like, mm. Next time on Smoking Gossip. <laughs> ah, Thank you, Barbara. Man, what? Tell about your YouTube. What happened? Yeah, the YouTube channel. Our YouTube? Yeah, Oh, yeah. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. It is Smoking Gossip. Without a G, though, on Smoking. The Just smoking, smoking the gossip. Right you know what I'm saying? Please subscribe smoking. to the Then they get real, YouTube real, though. Channel. Yeah, shit got real, real. Hey, we real on smoking gossip, though. That's, we what man, Jesus. That's what people get to come on here and do. Right, what it do? <laughs> I missed Ooh, it. Oh, we. Pee Wee said goodnight, Bree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. So, Pee Wee, I didn't even know you was here, bro. Yeah, My fucking face said you. nothing, no, bro. I'd have been you. announced you like. You man, was off B- the camera. Bree asked like, where you was. Yo, yo nigga I'm here. Yo, nigga here. Bree, yo, nigga here. He was like, we're spoiled. Bree, yo, nigga at the door. I'd have been like. <laughs> He's so here, bro. Kim, it wasn't that type of shade. No, that it was, was just shenade. like. <laughs> That was Shane Room. We're going to talk about it next time on Smoking Gossip because we're going to run that shit back. I'm about Doc cut the clip and, and the face of motherfucking man. He said, hold up, bro. Hold up, bro. We're going we're gonna to bring all that shit back because it's in Smoking Gossip and we br- try to bring y'all the greatest and the latest. And <laughs> NBA Youngboy is definitely the hottest and the realest rapper of all time. He, he's supposed, he should put you on the promo team. We're going to bring it back, though. Look, now they thirsty to know what he said. Yeah, you got to watch. You got to watch. You got to watch. <coughs> you got to watch, yo. They have nice videos, too, though. Yeah. Shout out to you, Glaze. Somebody said, well, when we going to have a girl from the Apple store on here? <laughs> the belly dancer. She got me blocked. No, she don't. I sent her a dick pic. <laughs> no, I'm just I wouldn't playing. be I'm surprised. Playing, y'all. I don't even get out like that. Look, Letitia said, y'all saying? know he was throwing yeah. shade. Y'all know it wasn't was shade. shade. It was just he was being, he, just he, said he it caught wrong. some shit that he, he didn't like. And he said it wrong. Family is family. Yeah. And every now and then, family come at each other a little rough, but that's family. Right. So we just witnessed some family shit. That's all it was. Right. They fine. Yeah, yeah that you know type shit. It'd be like that. 
definitely family shit. You know what Sport I'm saying? Family needs business. some milk. Why a they nap. keep trying to give me something? Give your bitch something. <laughs> <laughs> your bitch been tripping. Don't keep don't you, you keep trying to sober me up. Give your bitch something. <laughs> oh my lord! Why are you on that today? <laughs> Why they Stop trying to sober him, me up? Okay? Why they trying to sober me up, dog? I feel like I'm fun. <laughs> I <done> told y'all. <laughs> I mean, with this generation, that's a sensitive subject. You know what I'm what? saying? The Detroit, Milwaukee thing is a sensitive He's subject. Ready to live. Yeah, it's, oh, a, it's a sensitive. I respected it's that though. Yeah, I too. respect that because it was. I wouldn't say that Fan I was didn't thrown off with no by ill it. Intent. I got what he was saying, but it was for bro to correct him because. You know, <coughs> You like just this, say you sound different. It, yeah. It's not down in your city is yeah. what he was basically saying. Like, all Milwaukee music don't it's sound like Detroit because yeah. I don't. We don't. And we from Milwaukee. Yeah. Like, so I got what he was saying. Like, but I don't think that he meant it that way no. either. That's why they was just like, <laughs> really? <laughs> well, you got enough for everybody tonight. He don't sound like Detroit. He in his own lane. I think they all were. I, I think they all were. No, he, he just sounded <laughs> He didn't sound Detroit, and I think that's why he took it a certain type of way. Well, maybe he done made music that sounded similar, you know. But, you know, at the end of the day, I feel like there's nothing wrong with rapping over those kind of tracks mm. because that's what the people want to hear. So if you're trying to appeal to the crowd, that's, even if it's in your own town because they love the Detroit culture, even though we can't say that's Detroit rap. We can say y'all got to stop using a slang and all that other shit. Y'all got to. We have our own culture. We really do. I don't know why y'all keep we throwing that shit in the garbage. Else's. We got our own culture. Stop throwing your shit in the garbage for somebody else's. Exactly. It ain't fuck 12. We don't know yeah, who don't 12, 12 is. You know. You know who 12 is? When I was a shorty, we ain't. That was a popo. Yeah, 5, five o. O. Police. The police. One time. Yeah, exactly. We don't know shit about Fuck 12. 12. From Atlanta. <laughs> I'm just when saying, though. Like, niggas were saying 12. A lot of shit. You see, Letitia just said about. what I had said. When he said that, I was like, huh? Because normally people wouldn't say that about themselves. Because industry, like, I feel like when you're talking about rap, automatically sounds he like commercial. He's rapper. But you that's how he to. meant it, yeah. though. But I feel like other people read We're that as commercial. commercial. You yeah. don't yeah. read industry as real rap. If a, if a rapper come up and be like, yeah, I do industry rap. You're yeah. going to think about Drake and, like, Maybe commercial rap. That's industry sound. That's, yeah, that's, that's what, what he what meant. That's what he meant. But that's why his brother was like, no. We sound like Milwaukee, but we different Milwaukee. Like it's still Milwaukee. Like I mean, like I so said, they you both know how were right. Niggas under the influence, they say anything. <laughs> Look at scales. <laughs> <laughs> Look at spool. Do <laughs> I am not an example. <laughs> he you said, under influences Look at spool. plural. I'm only only under one. You're yeah. cu- under a couple, right? We now. don't know what type of drugs you took before you got here. <laughs> 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 Motherfuckers be off pills. On that note, Not this guy. that is Smoking Gossip Monday, episode 53. Do we have somebody on Wednesday? Well, we ain't like going to say that because that be going know, like, iffy, but, but like, just know, know Wednesday we may have a treat for y'all. You watching our social media, you know Smoking Gossip IG for updates. We're going to keep y'all smoking updated. Smoking Gossip Podcast group and page on Facebook for updates. That's how you'll know who we'll be having on Wednesday. That's how we confirm it. Mm-hmm. So. Any closing thoughts? Please stay Other tuned. than NBA Youngboy is the realest because he told everybody he has herpes. Okay. Y'all know NBA gone, right? So you know what he left, right? Strap it up, 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 strap it up. Also, RIP to Cedric. I'm pretty sure he can't fuck something, man. It's too easy to fuck a Milwaukee motherfucker, man. I gotta say, RIP to Cedric. So easy to get some pussy in Milwaukee. He did security at Jinx. Young brother lost his life on a motorcycle the other night, Saturday night. So I want to say rest in peace to him. Damn. Rest in peace. Rest in peace, brother. And we'll see y'all Wednesday. Wednesday. Hey, no, don't take us out yet. I got some more shit to say, uh-huh. kid folk. Thanks, Nikki.
Shit, she said that I was a good, good and glad I told them, you know. So, yeah. oh, and thanks. then Freaky Phil just told them, you got some word to me? I'ma let her go, y'all. <laughs> hey, no, I just on some real shit, y'all. On some real shit, I just gotta <laughs> say this before we leave. NBA? Young boy oh <laughs> is the God. realest rapper of all like time because really this nigga right. has herpes and told everybody. Scale still won't come out and tell motherfuckers he got the gout, my nigga. We out of here. <laughs>